Los Angeles-based produce pay allows growers with access to the market, financial solutions, and trade protection. But it's also working on sustainable technology and data that's used to improve the cycle of growing and distributing food efficiently. To help mark Earth Day during the month of April, CEO Patrick McCullough of Produce Pay joins us now on NYSC TV to talk more about this. But first, happy Earth Day. Happy Earth Day. I, what does it mean to you? You know, it's important to us because our mission is to change the world for the better with regards to human rights, water rights, and carbon footprint. Absolutely. So this is right in our sweet spot. Absolutely. It directly impacts your company. And it first does. of all, let's talk about your company. Let's tell our viewers exactly what it does. The industry has a lot of problems right now. It's an analog industry. It's still push supply. We're working on solving those problems. Which, we, by the way, it's a $1.3 trillion industry, it's a according monster. to the U.S. Department of Agriculture. And unfortunately, there's 60, 60% 6 economic waste. 40% oh of produce actually perishes. That's enough to solve world hunger. So by bringing digitization, bringing financing and insurance, uh, insurance products, we're able to start to attack that waste for the benefit of the end consumer. And can you tell me exactly how produce pay is helping the environment? We started with the farms. So we really thought that if we can finance farms, if we can bring uh, operating practice improvement uh, and really surround the farm, that we'll get pulled through and we'll create efficiency across the supply chain. If you think about moving this global industry of produce, sometimes from the southern hemisphere to the northern hemisphere, that's done through cold storage. It's mm -hmm. terrible for the environment. Mm -hmm. So any inefficiencies in cold storage warehouses or trucks is just brutal for the environment. And you're here at the New York Stock Exchange, the epicenter of the global financial markets on Earth Day. What would you like to tell investors? You know, I think this is a great time to be looking at ag tech overall, not just us. Um, ag tech has got a supply and demand macro issue, so we need more help with efficiency mm -hmm. so we can drive inflation down permanently. And how can consumers contribute to sustainable agriculture from your point of view? I think consumers need to demand more out of their grocery retailers. If mm -hmm. you go to the farmer's market, you see a different quality tomato than you do at your grocery store. Yep. You know, organic produce that goes through the mass market mm -hmm. is actually treated with ozone. Yeah. A lot of people don't know these secrets of, um, you know, dark secrets sometimes of our industry. Mm -hmm. Let me give you an example. Bell peppers. What's a fully ripened bell pepper in color? Green? Nope. What is it? Yellow, orange, and red. What? Every green bell pepper will eventually become yellow, orange, and red, taste better, sweeter, have antioxidants, healthier for you. Why do we harvest green bell peppers? The green ones, bitter, right? They don't have the same it's a, taste. It's a different That's taste. a preservative yeah. so that uh. we have more time to ship it before it perishes. So can you tell me about more future initiatives and what we can look out for? Yeah, so as we think about um, produce, one of the big problems, small and mid-sized farms um, rank 60 to 70 percent of the world's farms. Mm -hmm. Those folks don't have the ability to deal with disruption. Think about weather, think about supply and demand, which impacts global pricing. We need to help those folks. So the idea that your business goes bust every eight years because you're a small farm and you can't manage that volatility, that's unacceptable to us. So what we're intending to do is bring insurance product, future price products to market to take that volatility off of the farm and house it with professionals like reinsurance providers that know how to manage that risk. Fantastic, all good things. We think so. <laughs> Thank you so much, Patrick, for Thank being you. here today. Thanks for the time. Of course.